That snow is on the ground, especially in those grassy areas. And with the temperatures below freezing into tomorrow morning, you'll probably see it when you walk out the door tomorrow as well. 30 degrees right now. Winds are out of the east, northeast at three miles per hour. So your wind chill right on that 30 degree mark as well. High temperature today, 40 degrees, 12 below the average of 52. Now, this morning it was cold down to 20 degrees. 12 below the average of 32, the record low, 9 degrees, and that was set back in 1885. Well, this is what we're looking at as we go through the next few days. Scattered snow showers overnight into early tomorrow morning. I think things are going to wrap up here the next couple of hours for Pittsburgh. It'll go a little bit longer for the ridges. We'll see temperatures that will be in the or lows that will be in the 20s tomorrow morning, 40s in the afternoon. We'll have decreasing clouds late in the day, so it is going to get better as we go through the day. And any snow that's out there is going to melt pretty quickly tomorrow. And then we take it into Wednesday and Thursday. Both days we'll see temperatures that will be in the 60s, but also both days we'll see some rain showers and the possibility of a little bit of heavy rain as well. So, this is what we're looking at as we go through tonight in the 20s. Tomorrow, high temperatures will be in the mid to upper 40s, so, it should be pretty comfortable out there tomorrow afternoon, especially when the clouds finally dissipate. Here are the snow showers that are moving through. Most of it is on the way out, and we're just catching the back edge of this right now. Some light snow moving through Pittsburgh right now. Washington as well as Uniontown, Connellsville getting some of that as well. And this will continue to push off towards the uh, east, and we'll be left with some clouds into tomorrow morning. So we're starting the day mostly cloudy skies. The only places that really could see any snow till about six or eight o'clock would be the ridges and Garrett County. Otherwise, the snow will shut off here in about a couple of hours. As we go into the afternoon, you can see we'll see skies that will be clearing, especially the further north that you go. Now this is four o'clock on Tuesday, and then we have a couple of more systems that are going to be moving in. One on Wednesday, this is eight o'clock in the morning. You can see the rain showers moving through. That moves through. Here comes cold front number two. Now this is eleven o'clock on Wednesday, so this one's going to arrive on Thursday, but it could have some heavier rain showers. Possibly even some thunderstorms moving in on Thursday. So here's the morning hours. You have all the clouds that are with us, maybe a snow shower or two out towards the ridges. And then by noontime, we start to see the clouds decrease, especially north of I 80. Once we go towards 5 o'clock, most locations will be seeing mostly clear skies. But we take it into Wednesday morning. This is 9 o'clock. You can see the pockets of heavy rain moving through. Noontime, again, we could see some rain showers with those pockets of heavy rain, then finish it up with scattered rain showers on Wednesday. And then that second, Warm front moves through. That's these showers moving through at 6 a.m. on Thursday morning. Then at noontime, you can see the cold front moving through. So temperatures will peak at about noon on Thursday. Once this cold front comes through, temperatures will drop off pretty rapidly the second half of the day on Thursday, and we will have rain showers to finish off the day. So 25 degrees in the morning. We'll have those early morning snow showers, then mostly cloudy, 46 and partly cloudy in the afternoon, mostly clear the further north that you go. 63 on Wednesday for your high temperature with those rain showers. 61 for your high on Thursday, but that'll drop off once we get to about noon. Temperatures will drop in the afternoon on Thursday down to 32 on Friday. We'll have a chance of a few flurries around on Friday morning. For the weekend, right now, it does look pretty chilly out there. 37 on Saturday, 42 on Sunday, but we are looking at sunshine.